Good morning. You had a Eurolift procedure done recently. Correct. And can you tell us about what improved the most after you had the procedure done? Uh, bef before I had it, I had to sit on the commode of a morning and I dribbled and dribbled and dribbled. It took uh, 10 minutes or so. And, uh, and now I, uh, there's so much difference, I can't believe it, really. Seriously. You're, I understand that you also had surgery for your prostate many years ago. Yes. And you, you had mentioned something about uh, three years ago. What happened three years ago? Three years ago? Yeah. What did I tell you? I came to see Dr. Lynn, and he said that I needed some corrective surgery. And I said, at my age, I don't want to go through that. He said, you'll be back. And three years later, I came back. Okay. And can you tell us how old you are now? I just turned 88. Okay. And, and how... I don't like it either. <laughs> how was your... How was your Eurolift experience? No problem. I was, I was, I was so fortunate to just happen to see the article in the, in the news that uh, there was a new thing. Uh, I, I'm very happy with it. Did you have to wear a catheter after the procedure? Negative. And how much pain were, was you, were you in? Minimal. Did you have to take any pain medications? Hardly, I don't recall whether I did or not. I don't think I did. Okay. It was just, uh, it was just ordinary, incidental, uncomfort, uncomfortableness. Maybe typical for someone who's 88? Say again? Maybe it's typical for someone who's 88, the <laughs> usual aches and pains? Well, I have, I have a few others, yes. <laughs> oh, very good. Well, thank you so much for sharing your experience. May I share this video with those who may be interested? Absolutely. Thank you so much.